What up, Instagram and YouTube? It's your boy Salty Red Corn, and I'm back with another ill prepared knife review video. And today I want to talk about the Damn Designs Basilisk. All right? This is an interesting new offering to the EDC world, and uh, let's dive in and check it out. Um, I haven't handled it too much since I got it, so let's just go over what's going on here. So, on first sight, it's an odd looking knife, um, but it really makes a lot of ergonomic sense. They are locking you into one position, but the one position they're locking you into, it feels really, really good. So I can't really complain too much about that. Um, I think that the materials are excellent for the price. You're getting G10, stainless steel liners, you're getting 14C28N. Um, so that's all good stuff. We have like a harpoon shaped blade here that's acid stonewashed. Like I said, 14C28N. Um, it is a full flat grind or a flat grind rather. And it's very sharp and it's very slicey and very thin behind the edge. So it makes a lot of sense for an EDC knife. Nice jimping up here on the top of that thumb ramp. So it really locks you in and the jimping's done really nicely. You have a swedge up here on the top for some style. Um, the Coyote G10 on this is really nice, right? It's a nice finish of Coyote. It's got just enough texture to be grippy without being like overly aggressive. Um, and the milling along the top and the bottom, it like adds some, some style as well. Really minimal hardware on here, right? You can see this captive pivot, which is a nice, interesting looking pivot. Kind of looks like a portal, right? And then we have this tab. So this tab is for when you want to reverse the pocket clip. If you're left-handed, you can reverse the pocket clip, swap this tab around, and you're good to go that way. Um, we have a black G10 backspacer with a hidden lanyard hole all right so that works out nice for people that want lanyards and people that don't want lanyards so i think that's kind of nice super deep carry pocket clip the screws are not recessed into the clip itself but the g10 sits higher than the screws so there is no issue here getting this in and out of the pocket without a snag so i think that's really nice on the clip side we just have the one pivot screw and the two pocket clip screws holding it together so overall minimal screw design that's pretty nice I like that um, the knife is a liner lock and it the lockup is about 25% so definitely plenty of life here uh, <clears throat> the liners are skeletonized and recessed into the G10 so that gives a nice clean look all the way around um, I can dig that the knife runs on bearing so the action is very smooth um, the flipping action is very positive uh, the flipper is really the only method of deployment, although you can pinch it out right here and roll it out. So, you know, however you want to do it, it's going to work for you. It's it's a nice piece. I, I really like this knife, especially for the price. I think it's kind of a breath of fresh air as far as, far as the design goes, because there's not a whole lot out there that looks anything like this. And um, I can appreciate that. We have a little bit of jimping here on the flipper and it's not overly aggressive so flipping it is comfortable um, the knife came very sharp out of the box so that's a plus I like when a knife comes sharp that's a big deal um, because sometimes it doesn't happen right we have an internal blade stop here we have an internal blade stop so I think this is an overall very robust knife it's not super light it's got some heft to it so I can see this being a nice hard use knife for daily use. Um, it's a good size. It's like three and a half inches, a three and a quarter inch blade. Um, nice belly on it, nice pointy tip on it. Uh, there's definitely a pretty good like sharpening choil right there. So sharpening in the field is gonna be pretty easy if that's what you're gonna do. And uh, yeah, overall I like the finish, I like the fit. I think I might do some custom mods to these scales. I'm thinking about doing some crazy scallops and making this thing look super demonic and crazy looking. So, I don't know. That's damn designs. I'm going to go with the, the vibe with that and just see what I can do. Um, let me see if I can make something interesting. And maybe I'll do include this in a giveaway, my next giveaway. So, stay tuned for that. Um, enough about this. This is the damn designs basilisk. Let's talk about my carry today. And then I'm out. All right, so back with the Seiko SRPE or Dress KX as it's known, 48R movement, lots of power reserve on this. Uh, day and date, I love this watch because 
it looks like a Rolex without costing Rolex price. Um, I think it's just a really cool classic watch. This is like probably one of my absolute favorite watches of all time. And it was like the first Seiko, the first nice watch that I ever, ever bought. And I got this from Improper EDC. And I love this thing. It's got scratches on it and it ain't going nowhere. It's my, I love it. So take that for what you want. Um, still rocking with the Tactical Everyday Dad Kermode in Magna Cut for my fixed blade and for my folding knife today i am carrying the protect tr2 from steve Giraud. man thank you so much for this steve i absolutely love this knife and i carry it often so putting in the work on it and i love it man i really appreciate it steve thank you very much all right my firearm today is the same as yesterday pull it out for you guys i'm carrying the taurus gc three 12 plus one with the Olight Balder Mini. I know the light's not super good today. Again, guys, I apologize about that. But I did a custom paint job on this thing. It's olive drab green. And I like this and I trust my life with it. It's a fantastic everyday carry firearm, right? Mammoth Headgear Mountain Trucker Hat. That's going to do it for me today, guys. If you like this kind of video, smash the like button, hit the subscribe button, and tell your boy Salty Redcorn what you want to see. I'm going to do my best to make that happen for you. So until next time, stay fresh, stay sharp, peace out.